you see this happy guy? That's me, Michelin. My goal? To learn as much as possible about aviation. Check. Airspeed indicating zero. Horizon is uh, level in the turn. QNH 1021 set them both within tolerance and my brakes are working. Yeah. yeah. Hello guys, welcome. That was a long time I uploaded a video. So I thought I'm going out with you flying here in Sweden, my second home. And I'm gonna tell you what happened the last year where I did not upload a video. So let's get airborne and then we can talk about something. Sierra Alpha, holding point Charlie 1 for ready. Sierra Alpha, Levi 4, hold 1500 feet from below, squawk 6720. 6720, 4, hold 1500 or below, Sierra one one four right turn out clear takeoff. Right turn out one four clear for takeoff. Sierra Alpha. So parking brake is three off. Five the descend initially. To Fuel pump is on. Landing light, nav lights, show lights on. The carpet is off. Mixture full ridge. The approach checker looks clear to me. The runway is identified. And what's really cool about this airport is that um, I'm going to show you when I'm when I'm coming in that Koenig's egg the car manufacturer, they're building their cars actually right there and on the old runway from this uh, former Air Force base they're testing their cars so if you're lucky and you're here in Engelholm you may see a Koenigsegg driving on an old runway and that's pretty cool so I pay your runway, I use a runway runway heading is checked and on set the panel is checked the time is now oh, 10 and take off power. Take off power is set. The engine instruments are checked. We have a crosswind from the right. The speed is alive. 60 knots. Rotate. Positive red. Um, brakes. Target speed 75. 300 feet. Speed check. Flips. Up. And target speed 85. Yeah, what have happened in the last year? First of all, I finished the ATPL theory. Thereafter, I went to Sweden to have some fun with Gustav Salmanen in his bits. Back in Austria, I joined Diamond Aircraft when it did the training for the Empower. Then I continued my IFR training while joining Diamond again on a ferry flight to Dubai and back. Awesome. IFR training continued, broke a ground speed record with the DA40, took my friend with me over the Alps and was always responsible for refueling. Went to Denmark celebrating one year with my girlfriend who I took with me on one of the most amazing sunset flights ever. Then I had my last flight school lesson with one of the best instructor and friend and finally finished my flight training which I celebrated with my mom and dad and one of my best friends. Then I did the handover of the factory new aircraft of my flight school and that was shortly before it was time to stay at home. I managed to get up to Sweden where I got checked out on this Piper and now we continue with the video. Yeah. So, 
And now after all that, um, after all that Corona thing, which was going on or still going on, I managed to get up here into Sweden to my second home and I thought why not go out and fly and have fun here. So I got into the flight club here, the local flight club at Engelholms Flug Club. And yeah, I got checked out on this Piper Piper and I've had fun with this aircraft. So oh, what are we gonna do here? We're gonna use the autopilot. Yeah. This is where I uh I'm spending my summers. Um, it's called Bjerre Halvøen or Hjeldeviken. So this bay here is called Hjeldeviken. Very nice um, at my at the little town where I'm living. When I'm here, it's called Vibestrand. Um, I'm sailing a lot. Yeah, going out with the boats and yeah, just spending summer. And right in front of us, we have our beautiful Kula Bay, which is uh, peninsula. Just going out there, it's really nice. Yeah, a lot of harbors here. One down here, you can see it there. Uh, this one is actually called I don't know. Good question, but. Yeah, it's a paradise up here. Um, I have the harbor, or the boats, the sea. Then we have the airport, which we can fly, uh, which I can fly from. So it's a very, very nice, nice place up here. Oh, I love it here. Good, autopilot off. Oh, mixture rich carpet on, all lights on. Uh, one for you, one for the other one. 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 One for the other once after touch and go, make a left hand circuit for one four again, 1500 feet from below. After touch and go, right, correction left hand, 1500 over low. So I call for. Big one, wind is uh, 190 degrees, 8 knots, one four, clear touch and go. Clear touch and go, one four, so I call for. knots, rotate. Positive for it, bricks. The three and feet, speed checks, flaps up and landing light off now. Well, starting my left turn, left side is clear. Now you can see the airport back there. That's the runway where Koenigsegg is testing the aircraft, uh, their, their cars. You know some famous pictures where the Koenigsegg is standing right there. Uh, maybe I get the traffic. You see it? Sierra Alpha turning left base 144 full stop. Sierra Alpha 180 degrees, 10 knots, runway 14, clear to land. Clear to land 14, Sierra Alpha. We will clear to land, landing light is on. Mixture is full rich.
That was better. Oh, flips. Down. The ground for taxi Foxtrot to the club. Foxtrot to the club and thank you for the cooperation. Thank you. Oh, nice guy here at the tower. After landing check, fuel pump off, landing half lights, strobe lights off, transponder, trans, uh, standby, car beat is off, flips down. And we landed at 35. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that small or short flight. And from now on, I hope can upload more videos, let's see how much I get to fly. And yeah, until then, have a good day. Yeah, see you soon.